I bought uh, I bought Becca a new computer this week. Did you? Where yeah. did you get Rebecca? I got her. Th- this is the first time I've ever bought an AMD pre-built system. Oh. I was like, we th- thought we'd try it. It's a quad core. I don't know what they have a different numbering sequence altogether, but it's like it was a nice quad core. So, but uh, immediately put, um, yeah, big leap for her. I mean, she's coming from I think like I don't know a Pentium two or something <laughs> like that. My wife is so darling. She's always been, you know. Oh, don't don't worry about my computing needs. All I do is write and this and that. So finally, put something up there that uh, that she can really work on. Nice. And but in, immediately put Jaunty on there. No problems detecting any of the hardware. Hmm. Everything was just beautiful. It's got integrated Wi-Fi and everything, and it just picked it all up. So. So I assume you got a good package deal for this. Oh yeah, yeah, hmm. yeah. No, it was a great system. So, hmm. uh, but ended up now in our house. We we've got quite a distance between where Becca's computer sits and where our Wi-Fi broadcasts from. Mm. So even though, you know, I repositioned antennas and things like that, I was still not happy with the the signal strength at her computer. So I ended up running a Category 5 cable, which is where the name Mm. of the show comes from. Christy Mm -hmm. was asking me this week. So I ran a Cat 5 cable because I had a a couple spools sitting here So Mm. and uh, and got that up to her computer. So now she's running at a full, uh, like, hardwired connection on that system. So... So that's pretty cool. But something that I did learn, and a couple of our viewers had uh, had previously mentioned it, that if you run an AMD, some of the newer AMD chips, you're not able to install uh, Adobe Air, which is an application that allows you to run what we previously looked at, Seismic. So you can imagine my wife, who's all gung-ho for Seismic, not being able to install Adobe Air. It's pretty tragic. So... So we're looking into uh, any kind of resolution for that, but it looks like it is an Adobe Air issue. They're going to have to fix that. So if you've got an AMD processor and you're having trouble getting Adobe Air or Seismic or uh, any of those applications that that are based on Adobe Air or run from Adobe Air, uh, you might have to wait until uh, Adobe fixes that software. 